Jesus said this one day. He said, your life does not consist in the abundance of the things you own. Obviously, he was not talking to an American society. Why? Because be honest about it. That's what we're all about. We work hard. We want to get this. We want to get that. And in America, too often, people, it's about where you live, what you live in, what you drive, what you wear, what you have, right? Isn't that all about the current society? But Jesus said, no, the way of the kingdom is not what you get, but what you give. Living to give and not to get. It's not all about what I can gain, what I can get. No, but the thing that we struggle with, the thing that God competes with most in our lives, whether you realize it or not, is our possessions, our money. See, Christian maturity, there are three stages to Christian maturity. The first is the conversion of the heart. In other words, we learn to love God. We learn to appreciate God. We learn. But then the second reality of Christian maturity is the conversion of our mind. When we stop thinking that we know what's best, we start to trust in God. We do what God said and stop kicking back, stop questioning, stop coming up with all the rationales and reasons why not doing it God's way. It's the conversion of the mind. But then the third and most difficult journey of Christian maturity is the conversion of the wallet. The ability to trust in God.